I'm back! That's right, folks. Mr. Just Right One is damn sure checking back in with you guys today. I hope you are all having yourselves a blessed, wonderful day today. I first want to start this video by thanking you for joining me in this video. Take a rip on that one real quick. Man, today's video is a very, very cool video. And guess what? I have a giveaway in this video. That's right, I'm gonna be able to give you something back this time. Uh, a very, very cool company, man. The company that came through for the Just Right Christmas. Unicorn Mods and Mass Mods. Mass Mods, many of you guys may already know them, heard of them. They come out with this thing called the Axial. Well, they sent me a stainless one and they sent me a beautiful black one. Yes, I am a big fan of gold, but the finish on this stainless and this finish on this black are second to none. They also sent me some juice, so I'm going to be going over their juice, giving you my thoughts and opinion of the juice. We are going to build one of these Axial or Axel RDAs and give you my thoughts, opinions, and views on that. We're going to dive down, go through the ins and out of it, take a look at it, and come back up top. We'll vape on it and let you know the cost and exactly what it's going to require you to do in order to win one. So without further ado, let's dive down, take a closer look at this bad boy, and see what it does all right folks so let's set this to the side we're going to take a look at what this axial rda is all about so i'm going to tell you what i'm just going to do like a little pocket dump or such pouch dump is what we'll call this all right so excuse the fingerprints on this one because i was really Impressed by both of these. I want to held them looked at them wanted to go over them see what they were about and let me grab So you got a beauty ring you got your RDA uh, Bag of goodies drip tip uh, looks like a drip tip adapter a couple screws squonk pin and allen key and like a slam cap of such as well That's in the black bag or that's with the black finished and with this one here it is the polished high polished stainless unicorn vape same thing as in the others uh, beauty ring and ultimate cap I'm not sure how the caps come because both caps were in one bag I don't know if they're just like some extras they threw in or what so I'm not really sure how the orientation of those are and what you get when you order I'm pretty sure you have to buy those separate uh, let me grab a pointer of such and I'll tell you what I'll use. I'll use my handy dandy dandy waterfall screwdriver. So here we have uh, Unicorn Vapes. Very deep engraving. Unicorn Vape Incorporated. Designed by Mass Mods. Serial number here says... Let's do this. There we go. Uh, serial number is 308. And of course, it's not going to be in focus for me. Will you please just focus? Oh, best I can do there. Serial number is 308. Unicorn engraved in it. Little wings. Looks like they're on the side. Very nice. 510. And pin there. Up top. Got a really nice metal drip tip. Can dig that. Can definitely dig that. And then it also says it also has Unicorn Vapes Incorporated engraved there. Man, the finishing on this is second to none. I love how beautiful this thing looks. It's like a freaking mirror. Minus my fingerprints, of course. And we have airflow adjustments of three holes there which you'll see right there and you can adjust it around to just be wide open very very cool looking but as you know looks are not everything we're gonna have to see how this thing performs so this is gonna be a nice little interesting piece double o-ring here very very interesting deck offset coils of either side cutouts to allow you to put your screwdriver in 
there and there to adjust your or tighten down your clamps nice deep juice well really really nice and deep juice well really really anxious to get a build put in this thing and see how it performs um, what I'm gonna do first is I'm going to change out this uh, standard 510 let's see what we got here grab my trusty trusty Goalie stand or whatever the however you pronounce this thing uh, bearded Viking vapor over on Instagram man I love this thing got two more coming one of those has already been promised away to a Supporter of mine I'm gonna make sure he gets his hands on one of these But if you like one definitely go pick one up I do advise you purchase them by the threes to cover your shipping cost because it is astronomically high to ship from Australia or down under Wherever the gentleman is from with these right here, I promise you it is a fortune. All right. It looks to be heating pretty evenly across the entire surface. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to grab me some cotton to put in this and the cotton I'm going to be using today is none other than cotton, cotton threads. All right. So let that cool down before you just throw your cotton threads in there because if you don't, you'll melt that little agalette right there. I've already done it myself being in a rush. Trying to hurry up and get something done in a timely manner and just completely melted my little agalette. So, I know this is supposed to be designed to run dual coil and you would have one coil offset to one side and the cotton leads hanging down that side, one coil set down the other side with the cotton leads hanging down there. But me, myself, I'm going to do just kind of like that right there. Or basically, probably more so like that. That way I don't cover up my leads right there. Or clamp screws. So I'm going to just kind of lay them over. Put them like so. Shouldn't be much needed off of either end of these. I'm going to probably do it like that. And probably about the same on the other. About like that. Yeah, they look to be about the same. Grab my little tweezers. And just kind of grab the end of it. Lay it and tuck it where I want. want them the ends of that cotton to kind of be laying if not resting evenly with the build deck with the base of this deck and I don't want that cotton to be in the way of the coil either so I'm kind of just do some housekeeping on it like such and the juice I decided I was going to use was the uh, juice that they had sent me. This is Mox, a strawberry dragon fruit. So definitely we're going to give this a go. See what it's all about. I know I opened a bottle. Let me find an open bottle. I don't want to open one that doesn't need to be opened. Bam. Bam. So what we're also going to do is whenever I open this up and give it a go is I'm going to let you know what I think about the Mox E-Juice. Oh, shit. So here we go.
course, for those of you that are wondering, I am using my Sherlock Ohm, uh, Ohm Tech battery, the Sherlock 2, 2700, not 21700, but 2700 battery in this one. And let's give her a squonk and see how she does. That comes right. Look, I'm not even gonna lie to you. My battery just died. I'm not gonna edit that out either. That's like real world problems, man. My battery died. But as I was saying, guys, definitely go pick one up. I prefer the three dot airflow wide open single coil. This thing is banging out the freaking flavor right now, man. Like if anybody does not rate this like in their top, if they're going to do a point system of such and say, oh, I'm going to give it a 5.5 .5 or a 6.2. If they do not give this a 8 or better, I'd really question their integrity a little bit, man. Question their morals and values because this thing, guys, I'm not going to lie to you. It is a flavor banger. I am thoroughly impressed. Congratulations, Mass Mods. Congratulations, Unicorn Mod. You guys nailed it with this one. Like, I am beyond impressed. I thank you for this. I appreciate it. I needed something different to vape on to change away from my profile addiction. I needed something different. This answered that calling. Thank you. I appreciate it. As I always do, guys, if at any given point in time you've ever felt like you are not a somebody, I want you to know that you are a somebody in somebody's eyes and that somebody is me. I absolutely love each and every single one of you out there. Stay focused, stay blessed, Mr. Just Right One, checking in and checking out at the same damn time. And if you want to win your Axial from me on YouTube, you're gonna remember, I'm going to make you do something this time. One, I want you to comment down below, what do you think of the looks aesthetically of the Axial RDA and if you would like to have one? And two, if you have an Instagram, this is not going to guarantee you a, 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 you're going to win or anything, but if you have an Instagram, go show them some love, guys. They need all the support they can get right now. A small man team doing this, you know, mad respect to both companies. I want to see this RDA here become and get the recognition it deserves so if you want to win one comment down below and be sure to go over to instagram and show them some love tell them mr just right one since you mad love mad respect i'm out